गुड मॉर्निंग माय डी स्टूडेंट्स ओम सतो वक्रतुंडा महाकाया सूर्यकोटि समर्पवा निर्विघ्न कुरु मे देव सर्वकार्य सुसर्वदा गुरु ब्रह्मा गुरु विष्णु गुरु देव महेश्वर गुरु साक्षात पर ब्रह्म तस्म श्री गुरव नम ओम शांति गुड मॉर्निंग माय स्टूडेंट्स today i'm going to take class for grade 3 that is class 3 mathematics unit unit 1 mathematics in that we have covered two parts part 1 and part 2 up to we have covered comparison of numbers today let me start with the comparison of numbers okay hope you understood the previous parts and uh, let me explain the compare of comparison of numbers you know very familiar with comparison of numbers like comparison of single digit number two digit numbers you are familiar with even three digit numbers now we are switching to the comparison of three digit and the four digit numbers or four digit and four digit numbers like that okay all right here we can compare numbers to find out which number is greater smaller or equal to comparison is used to use of doing comparing two numbers which is may be greater which may be lesser or which may be equals to right rule for comparison rule 1 when the number of digits are different the number with large number of digits is greater of course if we are comparing three digit number like uh, 155 with uh, 1050 of course 1050 is a four digit number it is more than the three is number clear example compare the numbers 5839 and 448 right ones when ones place 9 3 8 5 right and uh, in a uh, these are three digit numbers 1 plus 8 4 4 in a uh, thousand place it is not there because it is a four digit number and this is a three digit number therefore 5839 is greater than the 448 that is 5839 is greater than symbol is this 448 okay clear that is the rule one the comparing with the digits number of digits now we will switch on to rule number 2 that is when the numbers have the same number of digits compare the face value of the numbers on the left the number with the greater face value at the at that place is greater number okay at the at that place is greater number from the left side means the thousand maximum digit value the face value you have to compare the face value of 2 is 2 1 is 1 won't change the face value of 9 in the thousand place 9 only the 7 if the place value is 7 in the thousand place or hundred place at the same it doesn't matter the place value and face value are very different that you have understood in the previous class right so here from the left side we have to compare the numbers from the left left to right we have to move from left to right we have to move if this is same then move on to the 100 place this is same then move on to the 10 place here this is same then we move on to the ones place and check the face value of the number so of course 2 is greater than 1 5 is less than 2 sorry 5 is greater than 2 2 is less than 5 right 9 is less than 7 no 9 is greater than 7 7 is less than 9 right so if at all you find any difficulty just 
take a time to understand this concept right so example 2 compare the numbers 1771 means 1771 and 2456 now place in the place value chart 1 7 7 1 6 5 4 2 this is the four digit number this is the four digit number then we have to as per the rule second we have to check from the left to right the face value of the numbers the face values of the numbers since the numbers have the same number of digits compare the digits in the thousand place at a thousand place this number consists of only one the face value of this number is 1. The face value of this number is 2. Then of course, 2 is greater than 1. The whole number will become greater. The whole number will become greater. Right? Therefore, 2 hence here 2 is greater than 1. Therefore, 2456 is greater than 1771. That is, 2456 is greater than 1771. That's it. Then the rule number 3. What are the rule number 3 states? If the digits on the extreme left of the given number are same, compare the digits at the next higher place value of the numbers. That's it. If these are same, then move on to this. If these are same, then move on to this. If these are same, then move on to this. That's it. So, it means that from extreme left to right, we should come. The highest value digits to lowest value digits, we should come. Okay? That is the third rule. So, keeping these three rules in mind, we have to compare the numbers. Clear? So, here... Both the numbers are both the numbers are four digits numbers and the digits at the thousand place are same. So compare the digits at the their number place. Compare the digits at their hundreds place, right? If these are same, then we need to compare this. If these are same, then we need to compare with tens. If these are same, then we need to compare this. Okay? If both are equal, then it will say equal. Clear? So, here 1 is equal to 1, means same face value, right? Then, here is 8 and here is 3. 8 is greater than 3. Of course, this whole number is going to be more than this. That's it. If you compare here, it is equal equal then when we are moved to the 100 plus 8 and 100 plus this is 800 is 300 so this is the 800 is more than 300 so 8 is greater than 3 3 so that 8 is greater than 3 therefore 1871 is greater than 1367 that is 1871 is greater than 1367 right 1871 is greater than 1367. Alright. What is the rule number 4 state that? Same thing. As I told you now. Rule 4 is. Apply the above rule till the reach. Till you reach the last lower place. Which is different digit in the given number. So as I told you. As we move on to the left to the right, extend left to right, we have to move. First, we have to compare this. If these are equal to, then move on to this. If these are equals to, then compare with last digit. If that is also same, the both numbers are same. Right, that, that's it. Okay. So now, example four, compare the number three thousand eight hundred eleven and three thousand eight hundred seventeen. So here. 3811 3817 This is equals to this both the digits are same both the face value are same both the face value is same this is 1 and here is 7 
So, 1 is less than 7 means this number is less than this. This number is less than this. That's it. You are comparing this number with this number. So, this number is less than this number. Means, 3811 is less than 3817. Means, if it is more than 0 0.5, that is less. 0 0.5, 0 0.25, 0 0.01 is also a greater than that number. So, now we are studying about the whole numbers, not the fractional numbers, right? Clear? So, here the ones column is different digits as 1 is less than 7. Therefore, 3811 is smaller than 3817. That is, 3811 is less than 3817. Okay? Clear? Right. Now, based on understanding these through four rules, we have to do the further activities, further exercises. So, here, as I told you, we have to compare first. First, we have to compare from the left numbers. This is the first number, this is the first number. Here, 8 is there, here, 2 is there. 8 is greater than 2, so that the whole number 802, 208, 802 is greater than 208. Clear? Compare the following numbers using uh, greater than, less than or equal to sign. Alright? So, next stage, we are comparing here. Here also 7, here also 7. These two are equal. Here it is 5, here it is 5. These two are equal. Here it is 6 and here it is 8. This is more and this is less. So, whole number becomes 7568 is less than 7587. That's it. Clear? So, here 2198, 1298. Here it is 2 and here it is 1. So, whole number will become greater. This whole number will become greater than this number because this is 2000, this is 1000. 2198 is greater than 1298. Okay. Okay. Right. Now, 5120 and here 5120. The whole number 5120, 5120 means the both are same. Then you have to put equals. Put equals to. Clear? Got the idea? Right. So, here in the next uh, bit, in the same exercise, we have a circle the number, largest number. Circle the largest number. What is the largest number in this? This is 2000, 5000, 2000, 5000. 2, 2 will become smaller, not larger. So, 5, 5. Both are same. Then we have to compare these two numbers. Here, 5, 5 are same. 1 is here and 4 is here. 100 and 400. The 100 is less than 400. So, 5,431 will, will becomes larger number in the given group. Larger number in the group. Right? So, next we need to move on to 9102. 9,000, 8,000, 7,000, 5,000. Of course, here 9,102 is the larger numbers because it the consists of the highest place value. Right? So, next is 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 2,000. 2 is lesser, 3 is lesser, 4 is again lesser, 5 is greater. 3, so, here 2 is less than 3 is less than 4 is less than 5. So, 5 will become greater. So, 5, 3, 2, 1 means 5,321 is the larger number. Is the larger number. Okay? Followed. So, next is 6 is here. 2 is here, 1 is here, 2 is here. 2, 2, 6, 2, 2, 1. These two are lesser number, this is the larger number. Because 
1 less than 2 again 2 2 are there no problem these two are lesser less than 6 so 6 will become larger so 6932 is larger number okay any doubts hope you understood this concept then move on to the circle the smallest number circle the smallest number all right larger number is over means the greater number is over the bigger number is over smaller number we need to compare circle the smaller number we need to take the smallest number among the given numbers given set of numbers all right here 5 5 5 4 of course 4 is less than 5 so this is will becomes a lesser number smaller number all right this is 9 7 3 1 1 less than 3 less than 7 less than 9 right so 1 will becomes smaller number so 1679 is the smallest number in the given group of set of numbers right so here 7 2 6 2 so 2 is less than 6 is 6 is less than 7 so of course this 2 means 2139 number is smaller number okay that is smaller number clear so 7 it is here 7 2 1 7 1 right 1 is less than 2 is less than 7 means here the smaller number is 1 the 1299 is the smaller number okay guys hope you understood this concept clear just try to listen watch the video concentrate okay try to understand the concept then take your textbook then try to solve this right right true or false right true or false right the four digit number is 9000 of course the greatest four digit number is 9000 not the greatest four digit number the greatest four digit number is 9999 after 9999 you will get 10000 so 9999 is the greatest number here 9000 is not a greatest number so it is false this is the greatest number 9999 after this if you add one it will move on to the 10,000 five digit number not four digits the smallest four digit number is thousand right because after 999 999 plus one is equal to thousand right below this it will be 999 below one thousand minus one thousand minus one is 999 so it will become three digit number so that this is the smallest four digit number true right clear the smallest number among the smallest number among these these numbers so we need to compare three 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 okay all are three thousand only this is one 0 3 0 right so here this is also a greater than this these two numbers these two numbers are equal 3003 so that the smallest number among these two numbers is the smallest number among these is 3003 okay okay next is the greatest the greatest number among 5828 8052 8025 8225 which is the greatest number we need to find this is the smallest number forget about this here it is 8 here it is also 8 here it is also 8 now we not we need to move, move on to the Move on to the hundred place. Two, 
2 2 here also same here will 5 2 2 so what happens you know the greatest number the greatest number among these two numbers these four numbers are 8252 right okay clear next is the smallest number among the smallest number among 5 1 3 2 2 1 3 2 5 here 5 7 2 5 so here 2 is less than 5 5 is less than 7 so 2 is lesser here it is 2132 so this is 2132 is the smallest number among the given set of numbers right any doubts so let's move on to the same ascending order descending order writing the numbers from smaller number to the bigger number is called ascending order writing the number from bigger to the smaller is called descending order stepping up is ascending order stepping down is descending order okay that's it so here this is ascending order 1213 is more than 2310 2310 is more than 2452 2452 is more than 3776 so that it is ascending order smaller number to the bigger number this is called ascending order arranging number from smallest to largest is called as ascending order okay clear next is arranging the number from the largest number to the smallest number is called descending order arranging the number from largest number to the smallest number is called descending order <coughs> right this is the largest number so as i told you 3 is greater than 2 2 and it is greater than 1 right so keep on doing this larger numbers smaller number still st smaller number still smaller number is called descending order means largest number to the smallest number how to compare that so just we have to arrange this example one arrange the following number in descending order arrange the, arranging the number in descending order right let us 6534 8793 4369 let us arrange the numbers in the place value chart shown as shown the thousand hundred ones tens ones ones tens hundred thousands right so here six thousand five hundred thirty four eight thousand seven hundred ninety three four thousand three hundred sixty nine so here in this case what happens you know so we need to compare this as I told you as I told you we need to compare the thousands column first we see 8 is greater than the 8 is 8 is a greater among the 864 864 means 864 means 4 is less than 6 6 is less than 8 so that 8 will become greater 8 will become greater so that we have to arrange arrange the numbers thus we have to arrange the numbers the number in ascending order is 4369 is a smaller number right 4369 6534 means 4369 comma 6538 comma 8792 right so like this we have to arrange let us consider example 2 arrange the following in ascending order descending order 4387 3298 3654 let us arrange the numbers in the place value chart 4387 3298 298 3654 right so here we have to arrange like this so here when we compare thousands columns thousand columns 
we see 4 is greater than 3 4 is greater than so 4 3 8 7 is the greatest number now compare the hundreds column for the other two numbers because their digits in the thousand thousand places are, are same right here 6 is greater than 2 here when these two when we are compared with 4 is greater than 2 this number is over comparing this number and this number is over now we need to compare these two numbers again so here in this case we have to move on to the this is the same then we need to move on to the this column so here in this case what happens here you know here 2 and 6 2 and 6 so 6 is greater than 2 means this comes second right clear huh. here 6 is greater than 2 then that is 6 is greater than 2 so 3654 is the greater than 3298 thus the number in descending order are 4387 3654 3298 okay any doubts hope you are following this concept thoroughly right now let's solve some examples of exercise 5.1 exercise 5.1 so here arrange the following numbers in ascending order arrange the following numbers in ascending order means smaller number to the bigger number now con let's consider 1 is less than 7 7 is less than 9 so means in the thousand place we have to consider this number this is the smaller number then this is a smaller number then this is a bigger number right so like this only we have to arrange 1400 84 uh, then 7109 109 right like this we have to arrange so next is here 5484 right so it means that so 4 is less than 4 is less than 5 5 is less than 8 so this is our and this is our the ascending order right then we need to compare with these two things in these two things we have to 4 and 4 are same let's then move on to the 100 place here it is 2 here it is 4 means 2 is less than 4 so now we have to consider this is the smallest number then this is the biggest number right clear so it means that first the smaller number is 4 2 7 9 4279 then 4480 then 5376 then 8531 this is called ascending order this is called ascending order clear so it is 2 here 3 3 2 2 means first we have to consider Thousand, thousand place this is 2 this is 2 and this is 2 then 3 3 3 3 right so here 2 is less than 3 first we have sure that we can, came to conclusion that 2000 is less than 3000 right then so here in 2000 we have 1 1 2 3 numbers then we have 2000 plus all over the three digit number four digit numbers in all the all everywhere this is two 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 is there two 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 is equals to two then we have to move on to the hundred place hundred place of the this number hundred place right so here it is nine here it is seven here it is four means four is less than four is less than 7 7 is less than 9 right means this number will become smaller so first we write this number 2417 2417 2470 17 right this is or now these two are remains right so in that 9 here it is 7 9 is greater than 
seven. So nine is less than seven. So we have to write this number. Two seven nine three means two thousand seven hundred ninety three. This also over. Now of course this we have to write two thousand nine hundred fifty four because next is three thousand. And here also it is three thousand. Here also three thousand. Three three are equals. Here it is one and here it is four. Means in the hundred place is one hundred is four hundred. Of course this is bigger number. This is smaller number. Write this one. Three one eight six. Three four eight two means. Two thousand four hundred seventeen and uh, two thousand seven hundred ninety-three, two thousand nine hundred fifty-four, three thousand one hundred eighty-six, three thousand four hundred eighty-two. Followed. Just we need to you need to have the patience. Okay. Once you understood the concept, you need to have the concentration, full concentration. Okay. That is the thing we are. It is required. You are familiar with the numbers. Okay. Then move on to the. Descending order, that is ascending order. Writing from smaller number to the bigger number. This is bigger number to the smaller number. Okay, so let's consider here. This is a bigger. So one uh, five is greater than two. Two is greater than one. Means five to one. First we have to write five thousand eight hundred twenty. Then two thousand six hundred forty-eight. Then one thousand two hundred fifty-three. That is the solution. Okay, next it is three thousand eight hundred sixty-one. This is seven. This is six, and this is also six. Means seven is greater than six. Six is greater than three. Here, here, this is the greater number. First, you are to write seven four one zero. Whereas in the six digits, we have two numbers here. Here, six thousand nine hundred, six thousand three hundred. So here in the hundred place it is nine hundred. It is two hundred. So six thousand nine hundred becomes larger number. Then six thousand three hundred will becomes next larger number. Then this is three thousand eight hundred sixty one. Means seven thousand four hundred ten, six thousand nine nine hundred, six thousand three hundred fifty eight, three thousand eighty six. So bigger number to the smaller number. This is called ascending order. This is called ascending order. Okay. Next, we have to compare these to these numbers: one, two, three, four, five numbers. No problem. So, first, what we have to do is: this is eight. Eight is greater than six. One, two numbers are there. Six. Six is greater than five. Sorry, seven is here. Eight is greater than seven. Eight is greater than seven. Seven here. Okay, eight is greater than seven. Then seven is greater than six. Six is greater than five. So first, what you have to do is what you have to write is eight thousand number. Write this eight five three nine. Right? Eight five three nine. Next is seven hundred seven thousands. Right? No other number is on based on seven thousand. So we have to write this seven thousand four hundred sixty nine. Okay. Next, this is also over. Then we have to come to this six and six. It is five, six thousands. Six here in the thousand place. Here in the thousand place six. Here next after this we have to compare with the hundreds. Hundreds are four hundred. It is five hundred. Of course, five hundred is more than four hundred. Five is greater than four. Five is greater than four. So we have to write six five to one. Then, then. Six four three seven. Then five thousand one eighty four. Okay. Hope you have followed these concepts thoroughly. Try to concentrate, listen carefully, watch carefully, then compare each and every results face value. Then you have you can able to solve very easily. Right. Followed. So now is here is the the following table gives you the length of five rivers. Arrange them. Arrange their length in ascending order. Ascending order means smaller number to the bigger number, right? So for that, what you have to do is for that, what you have to do is 
so here the smaller number is 7 start with 3 digit number here it is 4 digit number narmada 1290 kilometers length mahan mahanandi 8900 8000 uh, sorry 890 ganga 2510 kaveri 760 godavari 1450 right so here the smaller is this right so here digits are there the four, three digits and two uh, three digits four digits three digits numbers are small so just you have to compare three digit and three digit first 7000 7760 comma okay 760 then 890 here four digit numbers here one is less than two so means this is greater superior right this is one and here also one in this 1000 1000 here 200 400 two is less than four two is less than four so first write 1290 then write 1450 then write 2510 so the smallest length river is first is Kaveri then Mahanandi Mahanandi Mahanadi next is Narmada very next is Kaveri very next is Godavari and last is the highest length is 2500 right clear so here value and life skills Chetan's family very carefully careful about using water and keep the taps turned off when not in use they use 4800 liters of water in a month Weber's family waste a lot of water and they use 8400 liters of water in, in a month who uses more water why what are you what are your view on this right so of course this is a four in the four digit number four is greater than eight of course this Bible family is using more water because they are wasting the water the water is very natural source very natural resource once water spoils no life on the earth no life on the earth without the water no none will no 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 creature will be lived on the earth so save the water plants animals human beings we need water we have to use the water when and how it is necessary right unnecessarily you do not waste the you do not waste the water you do not waste the water clear wasting the watering water is a foolish thing because we can't generate it it's a natural source okay when the water source is spoiled the whole life on the earth will spoil so we had plants need water animals need water and human beings need water each and every creature on the earth needs water so save the water save the water this is the value and life skills you have to learn from what this concept right here odd and even numbers you know very well odd and even numbers number which have the digits numbers which have the digits 0 2 4 6 8 okay in their ones place are called even numbers any number any thousand lakhs hundreds tens of any number if it's one's place consists of 0 2 4 6 8 then it is even number if it is 1 3 5 7 9 then of course, of course it is odd number once again i'm telling you in the one's place any number thousand ten thousand five thousand ten uh, one lakh whatever number is there 110 whatever it may be so in the one's place 
in a one space in a unit place the number should be like 0 2 4 6 8 if this is so then this is called even number if it is 1 3 5 7 9 then this is called odd numbers odd number right so here 0 2 4 6 8 is 8 are called even numbers like that 1 3 5 7 9 are called odd numbers we need to check whether in the ones place if it is 0 or 2 or like odd or even numbers right so the numbers in which in which have the digit 1 3 5 7 or 9 in their one place are called odd numbers example 5 531 7089 4459 are all odd numbers as they have a digits here is 1 here it is 3 here it is 9 so 1 3 and 9 are respectively in their ones place so that these are called odd numbers okay so here is 9832 an odd even or odd number even number or odd number of course when you checked in the ones place it is 2 so that it is even number even number okay hope you have followed this means andre adu digit ones place alli 0 2 4 8 4 6 8 irbaru ittu andre adakke even number antare 1 3 5 7 9 ittu andre adakke odd number anta iste okay so let's separate write down the even numbers in the box 1 and odd numbers in the box 2 box 1 alli even numbers paribeku box 2 alli odd numbers paribeku anta heltare so this is even number this is odd number this is odd number because in the ones place it is 9 5 this is even number this is even number this is odd number even number so the odd number odd number the even number do even number because 6 it is one number so it's odd number this is 5 odd number this is odd number this is even number 2 is here then this is one no one's place only 7 is a odd number it's 2 is a even number it's 4 is a even number odd number 0 is a even number even number this is odd number so wherever I wrote E write in the even number box wherever I haven't written anything just write it in a, this box 3 4 3 3 4 6 next is 4 5 6 next is 6 7 8 2 means so next is 2422 next 3946 next 302 next 1,112, 1,212, next 3,444, next is 9,900, next 1,000. These are even numbers because under digit 1's place all are even numbers. So whole number will become even number. So odd numbers are 7,789, 1,135, here 2903 6703 8881 4691 91 next is 5555 okay then 1003 then 2900 67 next is 7577 next is 9999 this is odd number these all are odd numbers okay clear so now we have to write all the even numbers between 
2000 to 2030. So here even numbers between 2000 to 2030. So 2002, 2004, 2006, 2008, 2010, 2012, 2014, 2016, 2018, 2020, 2022, 2024, 2026, 2028, 2030. These are the even number between between 2002, 2030. So just we have to look, we have to check whether in the ones place it is 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. If it is so, then say even number. If it is 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, then say odd number. That is the condition here. So we need to write 6532, 6550. We need to write all odd numbers. Odd numbers means, uh, sorry, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. Okay. Even numbers are 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. Right. Here, uh, 6500. 31, 6535, 6000, 6549, then it is 50. Okay, that's it. Okay, clear. Next is number formation. Number formation. To form the greater four digit number, write the given digits in the descending order from extreme left to extreme left. Here given digits are 1, 4, 7, 3. In descending order 7, 7 is greater than, descending order means greater than, right? It's a descending order. 7 greater than, 7 is less than, right? 4, 4 is less than, 3, 3 is less than 1. Of course, 7, 4, 3, 1 greatest number is 7431 got it to form the smallest four digit number write the given numbers given digits in the ascending order from the extreme left to right the given digits are 4195 means 1 so here what you have to do is 1 So 1 is smaller number than 1 is less than 4 is less than 5 then 9 right. So here 1 so this is greater value right greater than 7 is greater than 4 4 is greater than 3 3 is greater than 1 okay then here 1 is less than 4 4 is less than 5 5 is less than 9 so means 1, 4, 5, 9. This is called ascending order. 1, 4, 5, 9. Okay. 1, 4, 5, 9 is ascending order. This is descending order. Okay. 7 is greater than 4. 4 is greater than 3. 3 is greater than 1. Okay. Clear. So, in a smaller number to the biggest number, if you are in, you will get a ascending order. Clear. Form the greatest and smallest four digit number using the digits 0, 3, 5, 7. So here 7 is greater than 5, 5 is greater than 3, 3 is, gre 3 is greater than 0. Means 7, 5, 3, 0. Means 7530 is the greatest number we can form using these numbers. And here, so 0 is less than 
3 3 is less than 5 5 is less than 7 means 0 3 5 7 this is how we can form the greatest sorry smallest reverse at it 7530 here 0 3 357 okay this is the smallest number this is the greatest number clear hope you understood okay next is next is remember if remember that if the zero is one of the four digits remember that if zero is one of the four digits then to form the smallest four digit number we write zero at the hundredth place and next is bigger number bigger digits at the thousand place okay so like this form the smallest and largest four digit number using the digits right this is smallest and this is the largest so as i told you one two one two four seven means one thousand two hundred forty seven we can form the smallest four digit number using these digits these digits clear so largest means here seven four to 1 7421 is the largest number we can form using these digits right so smallest number is 0 1 6 7 we can form the smallest digit using this number is this right 167 four digit number right four digit number means what you have to do is we have to take 0 at the 100th place 0 at the hundred place it, it will become four, three digit number so that one zero right one zero okay next is next is largest number is seven thousand six hundred one zero right this is the largest number we can form using the using this okay clear so smallest number we can use one three 8 9 is 1 3 1 3 8 9 means smaller number to the bigger number if you arrange 1389 is the smallest number here it is 8 9 thousand 800 9 thousand 831 is the largest four digit number so if you want to form a four digit number we have to write zero at the hundred place not the thousand place right right that we have to remember okay Next is smallest number 1459. 1459, right? 1459. The largest number is 9541, right? The smallest number we can form using this number is 2468. 2468. The largest number we can form is 8642. 8642, right? Clear. Hope you have understood this. Next is let's recall. Let's recall. The smallest four digit number is thousand and the greatest four digit number is nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine. The place value of the digits depends upon the its place in the number. Face value of the digit is the value of the digit itself. The expanded form of a number shows the place value of the each digits of a number. The number that comes just before a given number is known as the predecessor. The number which comes just after number is given number is the known as the successor. Okay. So this is the unit of your maths. This is the third part. Okay. Just listen carefully and understand each and every concept. Okay. All right. Here you do this activity as homework this is face face then cage then high cap right as arrange the numbers in a to z associated with the numbers 1 to 26 alphabets okay clear let's integrate 
so this activity you do at home okay if at all if you didn't followed any of the concepts just give me a call so that i can help you out okay clear till then take care bye bye